All right, let's roll. My name is Jamie Song. I'm originally from Seoul, South Korea. I'm a trainer based in New York City. Today in this video, we're gonna train our glutes, my favorite muscle group to train, with hip thrusts, our chest and arms with torso elevated push-ups, and our quads, the front of your thighs, with pause squats. And for all of these exercises, you can do at home without any equipment using just your body weight. All right, for our first muscle group, our butt, the glutes. Glutes are the strongest and largest muscles in your body. It's the powerhouse. Strong glutes help you prevent injuries in your knees, your hips, and your lower back as well. All right, let's learn hip thrust. We're gonna take a seat. You're gonna need a bench or a chair. We're gonna sit on the floor. Ideally, the height of the chair allows your shoulder blades to be on top, hooking over. We're gonna get our feet about hip width. I like turning my toes out a little bit. Without really pushing through your arms, push down through your heels to scoop up your hips. At the top, we want to make a relatively straight line from your chest to hips to knee. Lock out the hips. Gaze forward. For most of you watching this video, the body weight version will feel a little easy. So we're gonna add some weights. If you have dumbbells at home, perfect. If you don't have the dumbbells, just make a heavy backpack. Weights on top of your hips. Exact same movement. Looking forward. Press down through your heels. Lock out your hips at the top. Squeeze the butt. How many sets and reps should you do? Three sets, two to three sets is perfect. Do as many reps as you can without losing the good form. Next muscle groups we're gonna train are chest and arms. You can use the same chair or the bench that you just used for the hip thrust. We're gonna get our hands a little bit wider than the shoulders. Make a straight line from the top of your head all the way down to your heels. We're gonna bend our elbows, lower our body down. Touch your ribs to the edge of the chair. Push back up in straight line. Remember your chest and hips are always moving together in one piece. And as you bend your elbows, I want your elbows to be 45 degrees away from the torso. Don't flare them out. Don't point them straight back, 45 degrees. I'll just show you a couple more reps. Abs are tight. Come all the way down, touch the ribs. Push back up. And if this version is a little too challenging for you, you can always place your knees on the floor. Do the exact same thing. Lower, touch the ribs. Push back up. Next muscle group, we're gonna train our quads, the front of our thighs. We're gonna learn pause squats. But before we get into the actual exercise, we're gonna talk about the squat stance. Um, everyone has different hip anatomy. Everyone has unique thigh bones and pelvic bone that's mixed together. Some of my clients squat look like this. Some of my other clients squats look like this. Mine looks like this. So you're gonna find out the squat stance that you can first maintain straight, neutral spine, no rounding, no excessive arching, just nice and straight spine. And the stance that allows you deep depth at the bottom of the squat without feeling any pinching sensation or pain in your hip joints. All right, so let's get to the actual exercise. We're gonna get down to the bottom of the squat and we're gonna pause there for three full seconds. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, come back up. Squat down, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003. One more time. One, two, three. As you stand back up, make sure that your chest and hips are coming back up in one piece. 
You do not want to shoot your hips up and then chest come in. Everything in one piece, smooth motion. And if this is too easy for you, you can always hold the same weights. Squat down, pause for a full three seconds. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. So we went over today full body strength and muscle building workout. First, we started off with our glutes using hip thrust exercise, our chest and arms with torso elevated push-ups, and finally the quads. We just learned the pause squats. Awesome workout, guys. Thanks for following along. Have a nice day.